Yo, what's good, y'all? It's your boy JK on the track. And hopefully, I got a fix for y'all out there that's trying to use Apollo Twin or whatever Apollo on Windows without the crackling issue. I have the Gen 2 and I since I first came out and I had the problem with the crackling when I was doing playback on YouTube or Spotify. But um, this fix, I've been searching everywhere trying to get this damn thing fixed. But so far, this fixed it for me, what I just did. So I put this post up on Reddit, so hopefully people see it there too. Hopefully y'all could try it out and see if it works for y'all. Hopefully, because I know that's a pain in the ace to have them crackling. But all right. So first thing, you just do all the steps that UA recommends. Doing everything in the BIOS, whatever settings they tell you to change. I did that. The BIOS, disable speed step and CPU C states. I did that. And still I went to get throttle stop. Throttle stop is something that uh, changed, I guess, BIOS settings if you don't want to go into the BIOS. So right here, speed step and C1E, that was check marked. I unchecked them, and it stays unchecked. I run it, ran it once, unchecked it, and it stays like that every time. So I guess it runs that way. So that's the first step that I did. Next, device manager, and then I disabled. You go under system system devices right here you put this in the middle and then high precision event timer I right click that and disable device I saw online on YouTube somebody said something or actually I think it was reddit somebody said disabling that might help so I went and did that and then downloaded the free version of process lasso it's probably been the biggest uh, help right here so process lasso free version this pops up every time you use it. Say like continue. All right, so you have audio DG.exe. That's what you want to look for. It's either in all processes or active processes. If you don't see anything there, run uh, YouTube or Spotify or something that has audio, and then it should pop up. And then once that pops up, you right click CPU priority, always, and then you select high. And then after you select high, you go back. Right click again, CPU affinity, always select CPU affinity. Then you're going to hit clear to clear all the check marks out. These are all your cores. I chose CPU 2E. I had it on CPU 1 before. I was still getting a little bit of crackling, but I changed to CPU 2E, and so far it's been working flawless, no pops or anything. So that's where I keep that. You could try 3. I forgot if it's the odd number that it has to be. But I guess just try and see whichever one will work for you. Then I have that set. And then once you have Process Lasso installed, the next step you have now, you go to your power plan for Windows. So you have your power options. And now you should have something here, some bit some highest performance. You switch to, I switched to that. Went to change plan settings. I display in computer sleep, I always have on never change advanced power settings and over here turn off hard disk I have that set to zero I'm not sure if that was anything you had to do but um USB settings selective suspend settings I have that disabled Intel graphics power plan I have that maximum I don't know if that had anything to do with it or not process power management minimum and maximum I have set to 100% and I believe these are the same settings that the UA recommends also. But that's what I have. And for me, that worked for me. That's all I did. So hopefully that'll help you just to let you hear audio playing right through this joint right now. Sorry about that. But this is the way I got it working. No crackling, no issues. So far, it's been a smooth playback. So hopefully this works for y'all. And we see what happens. Hopefully they come out with a fix though for us. Alright, y'all. Peace.